education is the foundation of activism. It really comes down to awareness, visibility, and representation. At Athlete Ally, we believe that with education comes the power to advocate for change. It is so, so important to really educate yourself to not only be a great coach, but to be a great person in the lives that we impact every single day. To participate in Athlete Ally and to come to events to educate yourself will make an impact. So when opportunities arise, jump on it. Athlete Ally conducts workshops uh, really to help our guys understand issues facing the LGBTQ community. So Athlete Ally is a fundamental partner in our effort to effectively transition our players from their collegiate or amateur uh, careers into the professional ranks. Because diversity and inclusion is such a primary tenet of the NBA, we know Athlete Ally is one of the best organizations we can work with in that space. Knowing that we didn't have the body of education and there was an amazing group that did so why not reach out to partner with them right and have our audience learn from the best of the best mm -hmm. what you all do so well is um you hold space for grace in the learning process that really allows for a solid foundation to then do important activism and advocacy work i've had several experiences with faculty and staff that have been like, I've been able to have a conversation with my mom now about um, trans awareness and inclusion. It was very important for me for uh, to get involved with student activism, especially within the athletic department, because student athletes don't actually understand how much power we hold. All too often, the policies governing sports don't actually reflect the diversity of people playing sports convince the IOC to actually change the principle six in the charter. And then on top of that, we also got them to change some of the rules that they made for contracting with new cities who would host the Olympics to make sure that they would actually honor principle six, which would now include sexual orientation. This was a case where we really did demonstratively win. Definitely only possible with a partnership with Athlete Ally. The Athletic Equality Index, or AEI, is a measure of every NCAA Division I athletic department's policies and practices around LGBTQ inclusion. We use the AEI Index to uh, kind of start our, our LGBTQ plus inclusion. We liked everything that the AEI measured and, and we just went for it and that's how we got to perfect score. Everyone needs a starting point, and I think the AEI is perfect for that. The way Athlete Ally understands not only the substance, but the experience, the lived experience of athletes is tremendous, is of tremendous value to us as an organization. Athlete Ally has been an invaluable partner in the state legislative work over the last few years. Since we've seen this rise of anti-transgender um, bills that focus on youth in sports, Athlete Ally has been at the front of the fight, supporting folks on the ground, being the conduit between us and national and international sports news, um, and really helping to translate and understand what's happening, why things matter, and what the historical context is. At Athlete Ally, we work to make athlete activism not just accepted, but expected. It shouldn't be the responsibility of those who are marginalized to stand up for their communities. Everyone needs to do it. And so I'm just grateful that Athlete Ally has given me a, an outlet to do that. Athlete Ally also champions athlete activism by educating athletes on the power of their platform, by building a diverse coalition of athletes passionate about social justice, and by creating opportunities for those athletes to speak out. What I love about Athlete Ally and their work to combat homophobia and transphobia in sport is that it comes from an authentic place. The Athlete Ally created this model where, athlete, where LGBT athletes could be heroes and icons, but also could be really effective advocates on the world stage. She drafted a petition, and the next thing I knew, there were a hundred or more signatures of top athletes who'd won Olympic medals and were famous for all kinds of things, who were supporting the gender reforms in FIFA. I want to work with Athlete Ally because 
so much around LGBTQ uh, sports inclusion conversations, especially prior to the uprisings in 2020, have been pretty much just talking exclusively about your identity under that umbrella and not about the intersections of all your identities. So I felt really moved to bring my full self to these conversations and to be an ambassador for Athlete Outlier.